The future of our youth does not only lie in going to university or in going to university first time you finish matric. You can still access meaningful post-school opportunities and meaningful careers, by the way. And at another time, you can be able, if you want to proceed to university, be able to do that. This is very important in order for us to really break away from the cul-de-sac we put our youth and ourselves as a country into by emphasizing only one route. As a, a department, we are aware that this is a very important milestone, metric, in the lives of young people, and therefore would like to make them aware of approximately 425,095 opportunities available to them within the post-school education and training system. That is our now 26 universities. We have uh, an additional new university this year, Svago Mahato Health Sciences uh, University. Uh, opportunities in our 50 technical and vocational education and training colleges, which we used to call FETs in the past, and 21 CETAs, Sector Education and Training Authority, which help to promote and fund occupational programs linked to educational institutions and workplaces. Now, if we say then that this year we have got 425 thousand opportunities for post-school. This is an increase of 28,646 opportunities on the 396,449 opportunities provided in 2014. These opportunities, we can quickly break them down as follows. For universities, we've got 204,522 spaces for new entrants. 44,000 uh, spaces in engineering and business studies opportunities at our TVET, formerly FET colleges. Now these are what we call N, N programs, up to N6. And then we also have got this year 37,000 spaces for new entrants in the National Certificate Vocational Programs at uh, TVET colleges. And then we've got 85,900 occupationally directed apprenticeship or learnership opportunities in collaboration with TVET colleges, sitters, and employers. We also have 16,250 artisan opportunities. We also have a, an additional 37,423 learning program opportunities in the form of 3,380 3, apprenticeships, 4,513 bursaries, and 29,530 learnerships that will be further provided by the CETAs.